welcome to my channel crochet skills in today's video i will show you how to crochet this old uh, applique so let's start we will start by making that kind of round and as you can see there are uh, rows are kind of lines on it and uh, that just means that uh, we, we have worked it in spiral and in only back loops that i've started with a chain of uh, with a magic circle and chain of nine and uh, then I have just without making a slip stitch I just shifted into the next round and then I will just make in, make it in back loop so I have worked this in rounds and rounds 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6 rounds of uh, increase and after at the end of round 6 I have 54 single crochets and then in the 7th round I have worked 1 single crochet each stitch and worked a slip stitch here so now what I am going to do after making a slip stitch I will work chain 5 1 2 3 4 and 5 then I will yarn over 3 times go into the next stitch pull it through 2 loops pull it through 2 loops pull it through 2 loops and pull it through 2 loops yarn over twice again go into the next stitch pull it through 2 pull it through 2 pull it through 2 yarn over twice again Go into the stitch, pull up a loop, pull it through two, pull it through two and pull it through two. Then yarn over, go into the next stitch, work one double crochet. Go into the next stitch, work a half double crochet. Then in the next stitch, work a single crochet. In the next, again a single crochet. In the next one, half double crochet. In the next one, double crochet yarn over twice go into the stitch pull up a loop pull it through two two times again in the next work the same then yarn over three times go into the stitch pull up a loop pull it through two pull it through two pull it through two and pull it through two chain five one two three four and five go into the next stitch make a slip stitch so here are the ears and then I will show you what to make the next thing. Okay, slip stitch in next 5 stitches. 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. Okay, chain 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8. Chain 8. Go into this same stitch. Make a slip stitch. Chain 9. 1, 2, 3, 4. 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. Go into the same stitch, work a slip stitch. Go into the next stitch, make a slip stitch, chain 9, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and 10. This time uh, chain 10. Go into the same stitch, make a slip stitch, chain 10 again, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 9 and 10 go into the same stitch make a slip stitch slip stitch into the next stitch chain 9 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and 9 go into the same stitch work a slip stitch chain 8 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and 8 go into the same stitch make a slip stitch slip stitch into the next stitch one slip stitch into each of the next stitches so just look at it these are the wings here so now I will make one slip stitch in every stitch S skip five stitches from here from fifth six and seventh stitch I will make that kind of a wing here also and make slip stitches uh, till here and then I will cut the yarn weave the ends ok so this main piece is all done that kind of so now I will show you how to make the eyes and uh, ok so we will make the next steps here are the two eyes and how to make the eyes I have just make a 
magic circle six single crochets in the next round 12 single crochets in the next 18 and in fourth one single crochet each stitch and in fourth stitch that fourth round i worked 18 so i've worked the same together this is how i will paste it and then i worked just a magic circle and chain six so this is how i have worked this so this is how i will paste on it if you want to see it you can see but i just want to prefer that i will paste it and then i will make nose and uh, the other things okay so it's both eyes are completed now i will make a little nose by sewing small stitches like this small long stitch okay so little nose is done so now i will make that kind of white marks on it so now i will show you how to make these marks just insert the needle from any position skip two stitches under this same space make loose stitches like this please be careful while working with the needle Okay, it's enough. Four times it just passes the needle from the space we want to make a mark on it. Okay, so with the small space, we will insert the hook, insert the sorry needle again. We make the second mark. I will show you all the marks. Then I will be completed. Okay, four times I just passes it through. Okay, here's the third one. With one. With the same spaces. Two. Third time. And four times just insert it from the back side. And now make the fourth one. So total four times we will work this. Four time. One. Two. Try to keep it as loose as possible because then the result would come out you will definitely like it ok so make some more so I will make three more and then I will show you the next step ok so I am all done with the brown yarn I will make two puff marks as my I will make these brown marks for feet. Okay, so with this, we will make it on the bottom. And with the same pattern, I will make it by four times just weaving the thread into it. I think three stitches ahead. I think it's right space to make feet. Okay, one, two, three, four. I think it's enough. Just okay. Now I'd make knot behind, and then I will just cut the yarn. So one step is left. Okay, so the last part is to attach that kind of tassels on it. So how to make it, I will just take this yarn, wrap it around these three fingers ten times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Cut the yarn like this. Insert the hook from the 
back side from the central portion just bring it through try to make sure that all the loops are together now just pull it through all these together it's a little difficult but you need to make sure that you can pull all the strands passed by I think these two are left All the left strands need to be pulled out. <clears throat> now pull it tightly to make this not proper. Okay, so my owl applique is ready. I'll just cut it to make it smooth and equal. Oops, wait for it. Okay, so my owl applique is ready. I hope you have liked it. Please don't forget to subscribe my channel, like and share my video. For any query, you can ask me in comment section. Thank you for watching. Thank you so much.